Yeah, Milk Milk Seven Four. You know who he is, Thunder Loco. He actually, he made his he made his YouTube career off of who none other than Beyond Me. Why Adam Twenty Two or No Jumper has not demonetized his channel. Period. I, it, it's beyond me why they haven't took out his channel because that's all he does is react to Adam Twenty Two. After he was all up on Adam 22's nuts when he first started, he was like, "Oh my God, Adam Twenty Two is a god!" But then after he got interviewed, after he got interviewed, like a lot of people, a lot of people get interviewed. What's up, Activate LA? After a lot of people get interviewed, guess what? They end up hating that person, man. They ended up, you know, and that's exactly what happened with um, with 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 uh, uh, Milk Seven Four after he got interviewed. By Adam Twenty Two, he hated him. He even went over there and <laughs> he banged on the door. He tried to pick a fight with them. Come on, man. I mean, I'm not saying that Milk Seven Four doesn't have hands. I'm just saying that it's it's insane for him to go back over there. Active Relay says I used to buy toilet paper. Ahora no más agarro piedras. Ah! <laughs> hey, hey, we're gonna be there one day, homie. We're definitely gonna be there one day, man. But yeah, no to toilet paper is, is 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 getting expensive, just like everything else, man. But we could we could do that on, uh, on a future uh, episode. But anyways, milk seven four. So exactly, turn the local now. Now I'm not saying there's anything wrong. There's nothing wrong with you doing that. There's nothing wrong with you reacting to things, right? Because at the end of the day, people want to hear people's opinion, right? Uh, on on topics. But when you do it so much and so constant, where it's like, uh, you know, it's you might as well just. You might as well just call your channel Adam Twenty Two, getting his nuts or or, or massaging his massaging massaging Adam Twenty Two's nuts because that's what you're doing, man. You're basically just holding Adam Twenty Two's nuts and, and just massaging them and just putting his information, his videos over and over and over and over. And like I said, there's nothing wrong with that, man, because a lot of people do it. And but what I'm saying is like you're really with that video or that channel. All you're doing is constantly repeating what is already there man and like i said man hey if that's if that's your that's your st stitch then that's your stitch right but what i'm saying is he he i i want to say he got demonetized i want to say milk 74 finally got demonetized yeah yeah david barrera of course yeah no the hater world everybody that but but see hater world at, at least hater world does different videos for different people now, Milk74, he only focuses on one person or one podcast, and that's who? That's Adam22. Like I said, man, if that's your bread, bread and butter, then that's your bread and butter. But it gets boring, man. It gets boring when you keep doing the same thing over and over. Baby, baby uh, Love says, periodical, periodical, worse comes to worse. Exactly. No, no, no. It's insane when you do it every day, every day, seven days a week. It gets it gets too boring where you actually you lose subscribers, man, or you lose viewers. Maybe not subscribers, but you lose viewers, man. Unfortunately, or fortunate for him, his his channel has gone up to what a hundred and something, one hundred and fourteen thousand subscribers, man. But here's the thing: he finally got demonetized. Puts videos out there, one or two videos a week, maybe three or four a week. I'm not hundred percent sure because I don't watch him anymore. But he was putting out videos constantly over and over and over and over, which is fine. Like I said, man, people want to hear content. People want to see things. But now that you get demonetized, now that you get demonetized, you're like, oh, maybe, maybe I got to rethink what I'm doing. Maybe I got to think what I'm doing. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Activate it. Let's say it seems like YouTube is demonetizing us one at a time. Message they are giving us YouTubers. Exactly. And that's, you know, look, man. At the same time, you got to be careful what you say, right? There's topics that you can't talk about, but also you can't be stealing people's content. Look what happened to SS Sniper Wolf. If anybody knows SS Sniper Wolf, I know Activated Lane knows SS Sniper Wolf. She got demonetized for doing something stupid. But also, all her, all her, um, her, her whole YouTube video, her whole YouTube channel is based on reacting to people. And she doesn't even re really react to people. She, I, I got to say, man, now you're stealing somebody's content, which sucks, right? Now you're stealing somebody's content. You're not even doing anything. You're not. I mean, she's a fucking pretty face. That's all she is. Like, come on. Are you kidding me? 
Are you kidding me? But anyways, I can't hate on that. Like I said, I can't hate on that because she's getting her bread and butter. She ended up buying a mansion. I don't know where the hell she lives, but she ended up buying a mansion and, and a little teacup poodle or whatever the hell they're called. Those are like $4,000 puppies. But hey, man, that's your hustle. That's your hustle. Anyway, so be careful. Exactly. Be careful what you do on YouTube, man. You could react to videos, but remember, when you react to videos, you have to give at least 50% video a uh, 50% of your input on the video. You can't just let the video play and not say anything. You have to cut the video every, I want to say like every five, ten sec, five, six seconds. Cut the video, say what you got to say, play the video, say what you got to say. So this is something that I've learned, man. And that's the reason why I do not, I no longer, I should say, that's the reason why I no longer play videos here on the show, man, because I know that there's people out there that will take down your video because or give you a strike because you're using their content. So be careful what you do and how you do it. Yeah, the teacup poodles, man. <laughs> Jessica, 